Assalamu alaikum students. Hope you all are fine. Today I am here to explain your first assignment of class 4, English. Before starting your assignment, you must do numbering in your copies. Writing should be neat and clean. Don't forget to give one finger gap. All these steps must follow before starting your assignment. Now, question number 1 is Read chapter A Legend of Robazel thoroughly. Now, let's start our first chapter A Legend of Robazel. Today, we are going to learn about a Robazel and Glacier. In this chapter, there was a two men one is Robazel and the other is Glacier. A glazier was a very poor man and who worked hard for his family. And once upon a time, he was very tired for carrying the heavy load of glass. And the Rubazel is a mischievous person and Rubazel had enjoyed himself for making tricks. And in the end, a Rubazel successful in his mission for making poor man fool. In this picture, you can see that students he is a glazier, a poor man, and he is a mischievous person, Rubazel. Jaisa ke students, I have told you that Rubazel has been a man who 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 has now, question number two is make a title page of chapter number one. First, you will read this chapter thoroughly and then make a colorful title page of chapter number one. Now, move to question number three, dictation words. We have given ten dictation words. First, you will read it, then write it in your copy. Number one is dusty. D-U-S-T-Y Dusty Dusty means Dhool Number 2 is Brightly B-R-I-G-H-T-L-Y Brightly Brightly means Chamakdar Third one is Disappeared D-I-S-A-P-P-E-A-R-E-D Disappeared Disappeared means Qayab. Fourth one is Bitterly. B I double T E R L Y. Bitterly means Karva. Number five is Affair. A double F A I R. Affair means Koi Mamla ya Koi Baal. Number six is Promise. P R O M I S E. Promise means Vada. Number seven is Scratched. S C R A T C H E D. Scratched means Kurcha Hua. Number eight is Mountain. M O U N T A I N. Mountain means Pahar. Number 9 is Tricks. T R I C K S. Tricks means Char. Number 10 is Excited. E X C I T E D. Excited means Khushi. Now, question number 4 is Word sentences. You can also use these words in your daily life. Number one is laugh. L A U G H. Laugh. Number one is laugh. L A U G H. Laugh. Laugh means hasna. Number two is mischievous. M I S C H I E V O U 
as mischievous number 2 is mischievous m i s c h i e v o u s mischievous mischievous means sharati number 3 is money m o n e y money m o n e y money money means paisa now move to the english b section english b is basically related to grammar section and you should also do all english b work in english b copy question number 1 is give the synonyms of the following words synonyms means equivalent words it means hum mayne alfaz two words can interchanged in a context is called synonyms number 1 is abundant a b u n d a n t abundant abundant means zyada number 2 is allowed a w l o w e d allowed allowed means ijazat number 3 is angry a n g r y angry means gussa number 4 is army a r m y army means fort last one is amount a m o u n t amount means rakam now move to the last question of your assignment question number 6 is give the forms of verb of the following words there are three forms of verb forms of verb is basically related to our tenses first form is base form second form is past form and the third form is ed form number 1 is begin b e g i n begin means shuruaat number 2 is blow b e l o w blow means niche number 3 is bring b r i n g bring means lana number 4th one is build b u i l d build means taamir number 5th is burn b u r n burn means jalna if you have any problem regarding your assignment then ask me on whatsapp thank you allah hafiz